Allow me to introduce Robert Mandelson. He's been uh, cruising around Alberta for the last 14 years, facilitating the most team um, development uh, workshop experiences with amazing levels of fun, energy, and plenty of happiness. So we have another person coming into the into the shop here. No sit and listen and stand and deliver part. PowerPoint presentations here. His message is simple. He's a business it's for business leaders. Listen up, embrace the fun at work and building a culture of highly engaged and happy teams. It's the number one strategy to raise positive mental health at levels at work, especially now during the time of COVID and working together. So as an avid mental health champion, Robert is quite comfortable sharing his personal story of living and managing with depression. So his goal to be a role model for men everywhere and also to get uh, people getting comfortable talking about their daily mental health and uh, get the support they need. And over to you, Robert. Facilitate, sir. Uh, can we give Kathleen a, a big round of applause for Kathleen? Come on, everybody. Big <laughs> round of applause for Kathleen. Right on. And if we can give her a chance to introduce herself, because there's a, a fun event. A fun event is not a fun event without Kathleen. And she's here today. So you're on, girl. You're totally on. Tell us about who you are, what you're all about, and why you're awesome. Why you're totally awesome. I'm awesome because I know Robert. I'm a Cub Scout leader and Boy Scout leader, and we always try to make things fun so that they love learning what they're learning, life skills. And so Robert and I agree on a lot of things, and we like to goof off. <laughs> I'm here it. in Houston. Wow, crazy. It's crazy. Uh, listen, uh, f first, first, we want to thank Tanya. Uh, Tanya uh, intro has introduced me to or introduced me to uh, Connect Ottawa. Big round of applause for Tanya who brought me into Connect Ottawa. Come on, the, the big standing now, everybody stand up. Stand up, come on, stand up. Oh, I'm, so I'm the only one standing. Stand up, stand oh, up. God. Deborah, stand up. The big standing O, Deborah. The big stand. Thank you, Kimberly. Big standing O. The big standing O for Deborah. Excellent. Thank you, Tanya. Now, there you go. Way to go, Deborah. The big standing O. There you go. <laughs> and, and we want to thank Margaret Ann and Bernie. And we want to thank Denny. Because if it wasn't for their awesomeness, their awesomeness, I wouldn't be here today. So everybody, big high five for Bernie, Margaret, and Danny. Big high five. Big high. Come on, high five to the side. High five to the side. High five below. Come on, high five below. High five below. And everybody look at Margaret. Look at Margaret. And give her the big high five. Give her the big high five. Totally, totally, totally. Wow, who would have thought? Who would have thought? Tanya, you got a standing ovation at a Zoom meeting. That's crazy. Yeah, that's great. Turn your mics on. Everybody turn your mics on. Turn your mics on. Hey, Deborah, what's yeah. with the star? Share with me the star. What do you got there? I, I give out gold stars in real life. And now I give them out on Zoom. So whenever someone's doing something awesome, you high five, I give the gold stars. So who's next to you on your right? Bernie. Okay, pass it to Bernie. Bernie, pass it to Bernie. Take it and now pass it to someone else. Take it. Pass oh, it to Barry. Barry. There you go, Barry. Uh, it's in your hands. Star. Move the star along. Move it along. Hand, it's yours. <laughs> Oh, okay. <laughs> Here's Marianne. Grab the star. Move it along. Move. Uh, I'll put it down to Kathleen. <laughs> Kathleen. Oh, we're good cats, Kathleen. Kathleen, move the star. Move the star. Denny, Denny, catch it. Good cats, Denny. <laughs> Denny, move the star. Oh, good end. <laughs> Get Over to star. Janet. Over to Janet. <laughs> Here it comes, Janet. Get the star, Janet. Do you got this? Very awesome. Over to Tanya. Over to Tanya. Give her the star. 
Give her the star, Tanya. Give it to Tanya, Janet. Okay, Tanya, back oh, to Oh, sorry, Bella. sorry, where's Tanya? Oh, here she is. Oh, right. <laughs> here. <laughs> 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 and back over to Deborah. Back over to, did, did Kimberly get it? Oh, Kimberly, get the star to Kimberly. <laughs> Kimberly, <laughs> thanks for thinking of me. Get the star. <laughs> All right. Got it. Get it back to Deborah. Back to and Deborah. And final whoosh. <laughs> Hold on, wait. I love that phone ring. Who was that? It was me. Sorry. No, there's no sorry. Who was that? That was me. <laughs> oh, I love it. Can you play it again? Probably still ringing if I turn play it back it on. You. <laughs> oh, that's like a generational ring, right? <laughs> Kathleen would never have heard that ring, but Margaret, Bernie, and myself, we know that ring. Me, yes. We do. It's a cousin <laughs> to the top. <laughs> we grew up with that ring. And that's why I react. It's like, oh, my childhood just flashed before my eyes. <laughs> hey, Deborah, mm -hmm. get the star. I have it, yeah. Okay, do you, you, do you love? Guys, wait, didn't you get the star, Robert? You know what? I didn't get the star. Well, here you go. Okay, hold on. You ready? Got it. Excellent. Get ready, Deborah. Get okay. ready. Ready. Back at you. Back at you. <laughs> wow, do you feel the love? Can you feel the love? I absolutely do. It's amazing. It's amazing. It's amazing. And you Everybody... taught me an, you taught me a new game of pass the star, so thank you. Well, we just don't cap, call it pass the star. We call it pass the awesomeness. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> everybody turn on their chat everybody go to their chat everybody go to chat go to chat right now go to chat so here's your question here's your question what are you doing for fun what are you doing for fun in your business that's helping your clients with their mental health what are you doing for fun? What type of fun are you bringing into your business that's helping your client with your mental health, their mental health? And be specific. Like, like Kathleen says, wow, she breaks them chocolate. Hey, Kathleen, Kathleen, where are the cookies? Where are the cookies? <laughs> where in the belly. Can you go grab a cookie, <laughs> Kathleen? They're in the belly. You don't come back from there. <laughs> Oh, no, that would be horrible. Oh, grab a cookie. What are you doing? What are you doing to, to, to elevate your client's mental health through something fun? What are you doing? Okay. Apparently not. Somebody says we're having awesome conversations, but specifically, what are you doing? Are you baking cookies? What are you doing? We're on lockdown. No baking cookies here. No baking cookies. <laughs> I have breakout discussion groups in my talks. Janet, what are you doing? Heck, heck, you're in the medical profession. What are you doing to bring fun to your clients that will help them with their mental health? What are you doing? Um, well, it mostly revolves around giving them suggestions for how they might have fun with their family or even their colleagues. Perfect. Put that in the chat. Write that in the chat. Okay. Gary, write that in the chat. <laughs> write something in the chat, you bet. Kimberly, write something in the chat. Tanya, write something in the chat. Bernie, write something in the chat. <laughs> oh, wow, go for a bonfire. I started giving out gold stars in my live groups years ago. Wow. Here, I try to reduce stress for a family so they can enjoy their time together. Did you, uh, did you add something, Deborah? The, the stars? Barry, I don't, Barry. Try to reduce stress for a family. How do you, what are you, but what are you doing? What are you doing specifically? What activity are you doing? Go on fires. Oh. Find somebody, <laughs> find somebody who wrote something. <laughs> find somebody who wrote something. <laughs> Find somebody who wrote something. Just check out everybody's uh, ideas on how to bring over fun 
that elevates people's mental health, find somebody's, find somebody's uh, uh, activity that really kind of captures your attention, that captures your attention. Find one comment that captures your attention. Have you found one, Bernie? Have you found one, Kathleen? Have you found one, Janet? Tanya, have you found one? Okay, Deborah, whose comment really captures you? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Sometimes I sing a Whitney Houston song to them, says Kathleen. Oh, hey, Mike on, one of these. Mike on, Mike <laughs> on. Because I'm from, because I'm in Houston. Ladies yes. and gentlemen, live from Houston, <laughs> We are uh, so, so thrilled to have her with us today. Uh, uh, she's taking time off from work today to give us a 10 minute, a 10 second rendition of Whitney Houston. Ladies and gentlemen, a big round of applause for Kathleen. Big round of applause for Kathleen. Wow, you sound awesome. You sound beautiful. It's amazing. You sound just like Whitney. That is beautiful. That is stuff. Okay, enough. Enough. <laughs> enough. Enough. Okay, uh, Deborah, whose comment really captures your attention? Well, I like the cookies. So, who wrote the cookies? Uh, uh, the cookies. Chocolate cookie. chip cookies. Yes. Who was so that? Wait, it's Kathleen. I really yeah. bake them for myself and I give them a cup. <laughs> now, Deborah, I want you to talk to Kathleen as if she's sitting right there next to you. Right there next to you. And, and, and don't call her by her first name. I imagine you're sitting right next to you. And I want you to say, wow, Kathleen, the cookies, man, totally inspired me, Kathleen. What's the story with the cookies? So ask her to share with us the cookie story as if she's sitting right there next to you. Wait, so am I supposed to be talking to Air or am I supposed to be talking to Kathleen? Oh, you're talking to Kathleen. So <laughs> Kathleen, first of all, you're awesome. We yeah. know this. And anybody who gives out cookies is like, we're gonna be friends. So I'm gonna connect with you like right after this. But really, what inspired the cookies? That's just, I mean, I would eat them myself too, so. <laughs> Robert, am I supposed to answer? No, oh, you're, you're supposed you, to leave me you know, hanging. You're just supposed to have a pretty awesome conversation with Deborah as if she's sitting right there next to you. Oh, hi, Deborah. Your hair looks so lovely today. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Thank you so much. This is, we could thank COVID for my long hair because every time in the past where I've tried to grow my hair out, I break down like three months into it. I can't deal with it anymore. So I really appreciate your comment. Your hair looks lovely as well. Love. Yeah, I like to bake cookies because the smelling the cookies makes me feel happy. And when I can feel happy, I can transfer my happiness. Really, I do bake the cookies for myself. Yeah. And I give, I pick out five of the nicest shape ones, <laughs> and then, um, and then I give those as a present. I drop them. I don't hand it to them. I drop it off on their oh. doorknob. Wow. Oh, sweet! It's like, like, like they get a secret surprise. Yeah. And, oh, it's cookies. Or do yeah. they expect it? They're yes. like, did I make Kathleen's good list this week? <laughs> <laughs> yes. That's Kimberly, what happens. Kimberly, did somebody write something that really captured your attention? I like the bon Margaret Ann's bonfires. Okay, talk to her as if she's sitting right there next to you. Talk to her. Talk to her. Margaret Ann, isn't it lovely just sitting here outside listening to the crackling in the fire? And isn't it so nice and warm? Put your hands right up to the fire with me, guys. Everybody, everybody, oh, all together. Now. Ooh, feel the oh, fire. Ooh, it's so feel warm. The fire. Yeah. Especially nice when the temperatures dip below zero. Yes. Feel the I mean, fire. Warm on my body. Can you hear it? Can you smell it? Can you just imagine you're sitting in front of a roaring fire out 
out in the woods somewhere with your best friends looking up at the twinkling stars above you. Yes. And a full moon. Thanks for inviting me to the bonfire, Margaret Ann. I'm so happy to be here with you. <laughs> and thank you for inviting me, Margaret. Oh, you're welcome. I'm glad uh, you both did. And it's great to have a journey here, too. Yeah, it's Isn't it great. <laughs> you know, oh. oh, it's so warm. Oh. Oh, it's so warm. Janet, now that, now that we're all warm by the campfire, nibbling on Kathleen's cookies, is there anybody else to, who brought something to the table here that you'd like to sort of thank and appreciate? And hurry up, the fire's going out. Hurry Ooh. up, Jen. Ooh. The fire's going out. Hurry, Janet. Uh, oh, the fire just went out. <laughs> I'm not sure. I'm, I'm still confused about Margaret Ann's bonfires. Well, we oh. ask her, talk to her. Talk to her. I'm trying to take that in. <laughs> talk to her, Janet, as if she's sitting right next to you. Yeah, talk tell me, how do you arrange this thing? And where oh, do you do it? You know, that's so interesting. Um, how do I arrange it? Well, normally I would just put a little announcement out on Facebook and tell people I was coming. But since it was locked down, we have uh, done some, uh, you know, we had to pick some people to come. So I was thrilled to have Bernie out there a few weeks ago and we were all socially distanced. And it was in interesting. We had our friends oh, out wow. here also that have moved to Ottawa from Bangladesh. And what was nice yeah. is they asked the same question as you, Janet. They said, what is this bonfire thing? Yeah, <laughs> and, uh, they, I mean, it's not really so Jean Baptiste Day, is it? Yeah. <laughs> and then, so, so when they came, I'm like, wow, okay, well, I guess 100 years ago is probably for heat. But really, what is it? It's a community thing. It's about bringing everybody together so you can have conversations. And what more an ideal way to do it during COVID or a pandemic is to figure out activities that we can still connect and in the same environment but not be connected so does that make any sense it's fun. yeah i'm figuring you must have a cottage somewhere where you did this uh well no actually i'm very lucky because i can do that where i actually live but i okay. also have a trailer where i do that as well so bonfires and water are very important to me so i'm very close to both at all times wow oh, good wow. everybody arms to your right arms to your right everybody arms to your right arms to your right this is my right oh okay the other listen, right listen closely <laughs> and just repeat after That's me right. we're going to celebrate margaret ann she's all about community so it looks something like this community Community, 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 community. But you have to community, 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 <laughs> oh, that's better. Not that. What, is this too close? Yes. <laughs> One of the things we need to practice to have more fun online, we have to stand up and move around. We have to move around. So get up, move I'm around. Standing. Just move around. Stand up. I'll just move when I'm sitting. And, and go I'm close to the well. camera. And go far to the camera. Just go close to the camera and back to the camera. Go to the right of the camera. Move your arms. Go to the left of the camera. Hide. Hide. <laughs> and now come up to the camera. Yes. Awesome. Get yourself a oh, look at Kathleen. <laughs> hey, everybody. Barry. Barry. Barry, 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 Please don't choke. <laughs> yeah, it's hard to do Heimlich remotely. Exactly. That's what I was thinking. Yes. <laughs> anybody, is anybody sweaty? No. No? <laughs> we're doing it wrong, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> what does that mean? No. It means I'm no longer by the bonfire, so I'm chilled off. <laughs> can you can you Ooh. see this? Can you see this? Yep. Uh huh. Uh, okay, Barry, read this to everyone. 
plays the fastest and most successful. Time out, accessible. time I mean, out, so time out. Barry, 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 Barry. You and I go back how many years now, Barry? <laughs> how many years, Barry? What, uh, 15 minutes, 20 minutes? We go back. About that. <laughs> <laughs> so, Barry, uh, it, uh, with a little bit of Shakespearean emotion to it, emphasize some words, raise your voice, lower your voice, shift the, that, you know, not this monotone battery. We want voice elevated, voice brought down to the side, to the, Barry, you're on a little bit of Shakespearean. Go bass, Barry, Barry, go bass, go bass. <laughs> go bass. Okay. Bass. Play is the fastest, most accessible remedy for anyone. Time out, Barry, time out. Any adult experience. Barry, 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 my good friend, Barry. My mind doesn't think as fast as you. Slow it down. Just <laughs> slow it down, Barry. Just slow it down. <laughs> Slow it down. I'm like a little energizer bunny. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Go for it, Barry. Okay, play <clears throat> is the fastest, most accessible remedy for anyone, any adult experiencing mental health challenges. For it alone frees the soul from pain, sufferings, and hardship, and thus creates space for joy and happy to step in and ignite the spirit and energy. Yay! Yeah. Yeah. Awesome! You know, all you're missing is having the little the little skull in the hand going, oh, alas, poor Yurik. Oh. Debra, take it away, Debra. <laughs> Read that to us with a little bit of Shakespearean oomph to it. Shakespearean <clears throat> oomph. Go for it, Debra. Oh, I get to read the same thing? I'm so lucky. <laughs> a play? is the fastest and most accessible remedy for anyone, any adult experiencing mental health challenges. For it alone frees the soul from pain, yes. sufferings, and hardships. Yes. And thus creates yes. space for yes. joy, laws, happy to step in and ignite our spirit and energy. You see, Barry, you see how it's done? Do you see how it's done, Barry? <laughs> Did you, can you feel the love on her face, Barry? Can you yep. feel the love? Uh, Barry, give her a standing ovation. Stand up, Barry, and give her a standing ovation. There, there you go. Uh, totally. Deborah, stand up and give Barry a standing ovation. Totally. 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 Okay, mic's on. Mic's on. Mic's on. Can you see this structure? Can everybody see the structure? Yep. Yep. Can't feel, can't feel it though. Pardon me? Can't feel it though. That we're moving towards that. We're totally moving towards that. This is a, a straw and connector structure. And you can buy straws and connectors at your local toy store. So Janet, what we have here in front of us, Janet, it, it is a, stall, a straw and connector structure that, that honors that play statement, that play statement. Now, Janet, if you can, if you can share with us a little bit of what you remember about that play statement, even though it's not there in front of you, what do you remember about it? What do you remember about what was read? Oh, okay. So play is so important in keeping us mentally fit so that we can have fun, forget our troubles and hardships and pains yes. and get happy again. Yes. So, so nice. Thank you, Janet. Big hand to Janet. Way to go, Janet. Okay, point at her, point at her, like point at her. <laughs> oh my goodness. Show, ah. show us teeth, give teeth. Like show teeth. Like, like thank you, Janet. Like, thank you, Janet. Thank you, Janet. Give teeth. That's it. Now, Janet, this strong connector structure is a representation of that play statement. It honors the play statement, but in straw and connector form. In straw and connector form. Tanya. When you look at this structure, 
what do you see in this structure that is representative of that statement, of that play statement, in the way that it was built, in the colors that it was used, that were used, and in the form that is holding? What do you see here that is very representative of that play statement? Tanya? Well, you named a lot of them. I, I, I saw the colors first. You know, they, so it wasn't all just one color, it's a multicolored thing. I also, I also saw different shapes in it. You know, I can see a pentagon, I can see a triangle, I can see a square. I, um, and I can see that it's, it's three-dimensional as opposed to it being just a flat thing sitting on the table. It has, it has some, you know, life yes. to it because it's, it's taking up space kind of thing. Yes. Yes, Bernie, what do you see here in the shape, the form, and the colors that is very representative of that play statement? What do you see here, Barry? Barry? I don't know. Barry or Bernie? Sorry, I'm, my apologies. Bernie, we've picked on Barry enough. Bernie? <laughs> I'm not Barry too. I think I can be Barry one. <laughs> <laughs> so what do, what do I see? A pair of hands going through uh, time and space. <laughs> Start off with, if, if we're going to do that. Uh, I mean, it's a, it's a free-form structure. It's, although it has structure, it's, it's plastic. And not plastic in the sense of a material. It, it can be malleable. It can be bent. It can be shaped. It can be re repurposed, redesigned. It's not it's not fixed it's i wouldn't i wouldn't put my uh, house on as a uh, as a uh, basement and using that as support but uh, uh it, you know the mental the mental side the agility side the fun side it, yes. it can free form free shape yes. and then you can actually use your imagination to engage it and then find someone with hands to go through it awesome awesome kathleen uh, one more time how is this structure very representative of the play statement? Kathleen? Uh, I like the part about having an empty space for happiness to step in. Wow. I like that. Wow. Empty okay. space in there. Okay, everybody, everybody, arms here, arms here, because I love, put your arms here. I love what Kathleen just said. Uh, what was that comment you just said, Kathleen? The openness to let play in. Yes. Everybody. Ooh. Ooh. Ah. 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 Yes. <laughs> Every everybody go wherever you are right now, at home or in your office. I want you to find something something that you would like to bring and add to this structure that adds even more value to the play message. But get out of your seats. Get out of your seats. Go find something. Get out of your seats. Go find something in another room. Go find something. Go find something in another room that adds but even more value. But my toys are here. My toys are here. That's okay. That's okay. Oh, Do you oh. want me to go in another room and come back I'm and just take my the toys off my desk? Totally. Totally. <clears throat> Let, hey, Barry, stand up. Sit down. <laughs> stand up. <laughs> I, I just felt like saying that, Barry. That's all it was. <laughs> Barry is great. Barry I'm doing my exercise today. Ladies and gentlemen, a big round for Barry. Big round for Barry. Big round for Barry. Big round for Barry. Okay, Barry, tell us about the toy that you brought and why you want to add it to the play structure and where you would actually like it to go. Okay, so this is uh, from mine and my wife's wedding. Instead of doing um, like rice and stuff, we did like these string color banners. Did you say your wife's wedding? Like why am my wife's wedding? <laughs> okay. Okay. I was there too. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. <laughs> Just checking. <laughs> but we had a lot of fun at the wedding. It was a lot of energy and a lot of good fun. Um, where I would want this, I would probably want it hanging on one of the side bars so that it hangs down and you can see all the colors. Right on. Give us a demo, Barry. Give us a demo. Woo! 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 Barry, let's check in with 
Janet, 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 tell yes. us about your toy, where you'd like to put it, and how does it add more energy to play? Janet. Um, well, I can see exactly where I'd like to put it, but yeah. it's hard to show. Further up, 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 up. Yes, there. Yes, hanging from there. You sound very serious. <laughs> no, I'm not serious. I'm just it's focused on where I want it to be. It was, it was almost like she sucked the energy out of play. You will put it right there. Right there. <laughs> <laughs> what is that, by the way? What is it? It's, um, it's a little emoji thing. Now, remember, um, remember a few minutes ago, we practiced moving right, our bodies and our hands. So get and close to the camera. What is this? Come close, everybody. What is that? Like, show me what that is. Oh, it's very nice. And then the other side. Oh. Yes, Denny has pretty eyes, by the way. Oh. <laughs> oh, I like that. I like that. Thank you. Thank you for that. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, 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 Tanya, Tanya, did you bring a gift to share with the place? Ooh. I brought my Jenga blocks. Ooh, everybody. Ooh. Ah, ah, ooh. Can I can I show you one more thing about the Jenga blocks? What is that? These are why I have them. Because Todd <laughs> Conklin has all of his books with Jenga blocks. Wow. Serious and this play. is his last one where they're all on fire. So oh, serious <laughs> play. That was, that was, you know what, Tanya? That was serious play. That was serious, serious. Uh, I, 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 Sorry. I, I <laughs> give, <laughs> it's almost like you have to give me permission to laugh or something. <laughs> <laughs> a big hand for Denny. Denny brought a gift. Big hand for Denny. Go for it, Denny. You're on, Denny. What did you bring for the play structure? I brought my dice. Oh, let me nice. turn. Ooh. Ah. Let, me, Ooh. let me turn ah. off my background, and then you can see it better. Okay. And these are dice that we play with: four-sided dice, ten-sided dice, eight-sided dice, twenty-sided <laughs> dice. 12 sided dice. You I've never seen that. Six sided dice. No way. No way. No way. And so, so Danny, so what, 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 what's the story behind the die? Well, my wife and I are big Dungeons and Dragons players. Ah, so yes. We play Dungeons and Dragons with all of our dice. <laughs> wow. Yes. Everybody, arms to the right, arms to the right. Danny, 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 Now there's one more part to that cheer for Danny. One more part. Take your left leg, take your left leg, and your right arm your right arm and go, you rock, Denny. You, you rock, rock, Denny. Rock, Denny. <laughs> you rock, Denny. <laughs> okay, from the top, here we go. Denny, 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 You rock, Denny. You rock, Denny. You rock, Denny. You totally rock. Yeah, totally, totally. Hey, Deborah, take us home. The last toy, the last gift for the play structure. What's the story? Well, this is a little different, but it was the first thing that appeared of my variety of toys. It is a rock that says harmony. Oh, time out, time out. Ah. Did, time out. Did you start off with a negative? Did you start off negatively about that? Let me rephrase. I have an less traditional but awesome gift to add to the structure. Oh, yes. Kimberly, like Kimberly. Do the Kimberly. 
Do the Kimberly. We're doing the Kimberly. We're doing the Kimberly. We're doing the Kimberly. You're on, Deborah. Doing the Kimberly. Go, Deborah. <laughs> so, rocks may have a negative connotation. I do not believe that. This one says a harmony, which is really what you were talking about is bringing all those elements together is harmony. So this is almost like the sign for the playground. Yes. Yes. So because it's it, it's 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 harmony bringing them all together bringing it all together. Ask everybody to show and tell what they brought one more time. Show, show it. Now all at the same time, show it, show it, all at the same time. Oh. Denny, get your dice. Everybody at the same time, Kimberly, get your get I your know dice. this is too funny though. Oh, there you go. Uh, uh, show and tell. Show and tell. Everybody tell your story at the same time, at the count of three. One, two, three. Start talking. Having fun is so easy. Really? It's just something you need to do every day. I love my dye. Ignite your energy. Learn away all of your problems. Thank you, Cher. Ignite your dye. So you can make fun. It's so easy. There you go. You know, I didn't understand a thing. I didn't understand a thing. But I do want to ask about uh, Kathleen's. Uh, I'm not sure what that is, Kathleen, but I do have to ask. What is that? It's a Cub Scout bird. Yes. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I forgot we're not on mute. <laughs> That's no, no, okay. What is it's that? It's an eagle. Oh, it's an yes. eagle. Yes. It's an bird. eagle. A Cub Scout eagle. Yes. Wow. You're right. That's crazy. Someone made it for me. Oh, nice. Wow. Uh, I like it. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. Uh, wow. Uh, uh, everybody, gives every, give everybody a standing ovation, a big standing ovation. Give them the big standing O. Big standing O. Totally. Totally, totally, totally. Throw, throw a little bit of love to Bernie. A little bit of love to Bernie. Throw a little love to Bernie. Throw I flipped the dog love. back out. The, the yes. dog did not want to. Dog did not want to be plucked up and going. Look, there's your dog. <laughs> he's small, but he's not. He's not feeling plucky. <laughs> so I'm now gonna. I'm now gonna release him from the room. <laughs> Otherwise, it would be Dungeons and Dragons the wrong way. <laughs> Okay, uh, give me one second here, one second here. We're gonna wrap it up. You guys are awesome. You guys are awesome. We're gonna wrap it up with uh, what I call the, uh, the, uh, uh, the, the fun at work at home chant. The fun at work at home chant, number one. And we'll just go to screen share. You can see that I'm not, I'm te technology. My dog wanted to come too. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. In at number two, my number two fun belief. My number two fun belief. I feel good about playing all together now. Stand up. Stand up, everybody. You're the number two fun belief. In order to bring more fun at work at home, all together now, the count of two. One, two. I feel good. That was pathetic. That was yeah. pathetic. There was, there was no feeling good in that. No <laughs> feeling good. Okay, one more time. I feel I good about playing. Play. I feel good about playing. I feel good about playing. Play. 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 Okay, just, just Janet. Just Janet. Go for it, Janet. Just Janet. Me? Yeah, just Janet. <laughs> Okay, I feel great about playing. <laughs> Terrific, lovely, fun. <laughs> That's good. In at number three, can you see number three? No. 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 Not yet. Not yet. <laughs> Give me a sec. Number three, number three, number three, number three. Here we go. Number three. I don't need any special equipment. Heck, I don't even need to be in shape. <laughs> Okay, all together now. Stand up, stand up. Call it out, Bernie. You want me to talk? 
Yeah. Well, let me let me squint down and read my uh, screen again. I don't need any special <laughs> equipment. Heck, I don't even need to be in shape. Yeah. Hooray! Mind you, mind you, I do have a shape though. Yes, me Round. too. <laughs> we've got two more we've got two more two more hang in there hang in there we've got two more man this screen sharing is like really complicated uh four 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 here we go in at number four the capacity exists within me to maintain place momentum go for it janet stand up get everybody up. no i'm not going to stand up i can move just like this it's terrific <laughs> yes why not go for it janet yeah I'm, I'm keeping up the momentum all on my own <laughs> when you need to hire momentum you hire janet you hire janet <laughs> you hire janet. you know my secret if we're having a long session i always have dance breaks for everyone Wow. Ah. Uh, make sure I attend. Nice. Please make do sure that. I, I totally do that. We're make like sure, the same. Make yes. sure I Guys, <laughs> why wasn't that in the chat? Yeah. When Robert asked for that, where was that? <laughs> where was that? Where was that? They never nice. thought. Hey? You need to put the dance stuff in the chat. So that we can all download <laughs> it and remember Tanya. that dancing oh, is in the chat. The okay. <laughs> And in at number five, all together now, everybody up. Give your, everybody up. Give yourself a big ovation. Everybody up. Give yourselves a big ovation. Are you still there, Kimberly? Kimberly? Deborah, are you still there? I am. Can you read it out to everybody? I would be happy to. I empower people to stretch their imaginations through creative play. Awesome. Awesome. Totally. 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 Give somebody a big high five. Give somebody a big high five. Give them a low high five. Give them a low high five. Give them a high five five on the side. Give them a high. Margaret, one comment. Something you love to see in somebody else today. What somebody you saw play today, what you loved about it, somebody else. That they're laughing. No, one person, tell one, one, one quick, somebody you saw doing something today that you love to see because it was playful. One person, give them Barry. a- I love to watch Barry have fun. <laughs> Barry, one, one person who really stood out for you today. What did you love? Janet. I love your energy you bring with it. You really broke out of that bubble. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> and one thing you saw today that just caught your heart. One thing. Uh, actually, actually, yes, I loved, I loved Barry's um, shaky tinsel thing. Yes. It's great. Yes. Lovely. I like that totally. very much. <laughs> Totally. Jan, uh, uh, Barry, back to you. Pick somebody, somebody else that you really love to watch having fun today. Tanya was dancing away. It was great. Yeah. You know, dancing. Loosen it up, hey, baby. <laughs> Tanya, Tanya, what did you see today that really, really kind of caught your attention? You said, that was so cool to see that person having fun. I loved Deborah's star. And, yes. and the past star. Totally. <laughs> Yeah, totally. 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 Deborah, one person, one person, give them some awesomeness. Give them some well, awesomeness. I have to choose because everybody is awesome. Can I choose you? Yes. I'm going to choose <laughs> you for bringing all this joy and happy and play into our lives today. My Thank invoice you. is in the mail as we speak. I loved watching Denny because he just didn't know what to do with his dice. He just really didn't know what to do. It's just like, it's just like big man, little dice, big man, little dice. That's all I have to say. I love watching Denny. He was awesome today. Awesome. So Denny, I, I want to cut this party short, but yes, <laughs> she's going to. <laughs> no. I'm the party pooper. No, yes. I'm not. But, uh... <laughs> no, 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 no. Uh, so, Robert, I don't know if you, you can have a minute to. Uh, do you want? Can I go? Take. I'll, I'll go. Okay. 
you know what? I really enjoyed having you out, Robert. Like that was a lot of fun, got a lot of smiles on people's faces. Um, this whole exercise was actually to start introducing people to what Robert does because the pivot online has been a little bit different. So you can actually see from this how you can have fun online and do some team building. So I encourage you to go back to the places that you work, uh, you know, corporations or whatever, because that's what Robert does. He comes in and he allows people to have some fun, break loose and put a smile on people's face. So I absolutely loved it, Robert. Thank you. No, thank uh, you.